Hello and welcome back to our YouTube channel where we constantly update you with trendy topics. Today I have come up with 5 important quant topics for Goldman Sachs. But before we get started, make sure to hit the like and the subscribe button to our YouTube channel. Also, do not forget to hit the bell icon as we keep coming up with more such content daily. So, Goldman Sachs has just changed their syllabus for 2021 on and off campus recruitment. But don't worry because Cantilever Labs has it all covered for you. I am Janika and let's get started. Let's first have an overview of its test pattern. Goldman Sachs has two rounds in its off-campus drive, one for the technical round and the other for an aptitude test. So for round one, which is the aptitude test, as you can see on the screen here, we will have 66 MCQ questions in a time duration of 90 minutes, where six sections are mandatory and the marking scheme is, five, is plus five for a correct answer and minus two for an incorrect answer. Similarly, for round two, which is a technical round, you will have 20 questions, 15 for MCQ and 5 for subjective type, and a total duration of 135 minutes where 5 sections are mandatory. Again here the marking scheme is the same, for plus 5 for correct answers, minus 2 for incorrect answers, and plus 10 for correct subjective answers. Kindly note that the quantitative section is a part of both round 1 and round 2 of the recruitment drive. So, for round 1 as discussed earlier, which is the aptitude test, you will have 6 sections in total and 66 questions to solve in a time duration of 90 minutes. Here a plus point is that you can switch between sections, but also remember that there is negative marking in this paper, so solve accordingly. The quantitative section comprises of the first two sections of round 1, which is the aptitude test. Under this, section 1 is numerical computation and section 2 is numerical reasoning. Under numerical computation, you will have 8 questions and for numerical reasoning, you will have 12 questions. This part assesses number system, arithmetic, elementary statistics, and data interpretation. For numerical computation, this part includes general quant topics like time and work, percentages, profit and losses, etc., which I will discuss shortly, so kindly stay put. And for numerical reasoning, as its name suggests, it includes topics like letter series, number series, and find the missing numbers and letters. So now, as promised earlier, let's take a look at the five most important quantitative topics for Goldman Sachs. As you can see on the screen here, you will have approximately 0 to 1 questions on all of these topics. The most important ones are highlighted in red. Let's take a look at it. So the five most important ones are permutation and combination, logarithms, mixtures and allegations, boats and streams, and finally, time and work. The other topics as displayed on the screen are also important, but these ones highlighted in red are the most important ones. So kindly don't miss out on these topics. So that's all for today's video. Do comment below if you have any queries and we'll be happy to answer them. Until we meet next time, do like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon for all further updates as Candidly One Apps is passionate about building a platform for you to get into your dream jobs. Also, do not forget to check out our website as we have some placement courses for you. And also check out our Instagram and Discord channels as we keep updating them with tailor fit content just for you. Until then, thank you for watching and all the very best for your preparation.